Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this soda bottle. For this project, I have three different designs. This is the soda in the glass, and then bottle soda this is from different brand. Today, I'm going to show you how to make this one. For this project, we're going to set our room as a little V here and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, we're going to do this part so you can use any color that you like to use for your soda. I'm going to take one single band, start from first to second on the center. Two bands of green colors from first on your left to second on the center. And then two bands from first to second on your left, two bands, second to third, two bands, third to fourth, two bands, fourth to fifth. And we're going to repeat this and do it on your right. Two bands. From first on your right to second on the center. Two bands. First to second on your right. Two bands of green colors. Second to third on your right. Third to fourth. And fourth to fifth. I'm going to start right here. Now we're going to do the center part. From second to third, two bands. Third to fourth on the center, two bands. And then two bands. Now we're going to make the labels part. I'm going to use red. You can use other colors. Two bands of label colors. Two bands. And two bands on the center. Two bands on the center. And then two bands on your right. And two bands on your right. This is for the label on the bottle. Now we're going to get back to the green colors. Two bands. Two bands. Two bands for the green colors that you use. And now we're going to get back to the clear bands for the bottle. We're going to continue on in the center. Two bands. And then we're going to take two bands. Start it from the last one on your left and go on in on the last one on the center. Two bands. From the last one on your right to the last one on the center. And right here it's going to have little bit, little upside down V here. Now we're going to take three bands and continue on on the center. And next we're going to do the cap. Here I'm going to use the same color like label. So I'm going to use three red band. Continue on on the center here. And now I'm going to take one single band, twist two times. You see three rings here. And then press right here, the last one on the center. Now I'm going to press horizontal band. I'm going to take one single band and make an upside down triangle here. And next one, I'm going to take one single band. Make an upside down triangle here, but this time I'm going to hold on to this upside down triangle and then twist it and make another half loop like this to the center here. So for this horizontal band, it's going to be one and half loop. And we're going to do the same thing for the next one. Take one single band, make an upside down triangle here, but hold on to your band, twist it and make another half loop on the center like this. Next, I'm going to take the label color, take one single band, make an upside down triangle, label color, upside down triangle, and then green color, upside down triangle. We're going to take one single band and make a one and a half loop like we did for uh, before. Make an upside down triangle first and then twist it and make another half loop to the center here. And now we're ready looping the band. Let's rotate our loom and start looping. Now we're going to start right here. Reach under the cap band, grab all three bands and hook it to the next one here. And the same, grab all three bands and hook it to the next one. 
Next one, we're going to look for this two pen. It should be the first two. Grab it and hook it to the next one here. And next, I'm going to look for this two pen. It should be the next two. Grab it and hook it to your right. And now we're going to find the last two and hook it to the next one on the center. So right here, you have three teardrop here, nice and neat. Now, we're going to start working on your left. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Stay inside horizontal bang, grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. 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 And when you come to the end here, we're going to look for these two bands. And the same, go out the bottom two. And be careful. There's a tension here. We can reduce the tension first. And slowly grab it. And hook it to the second to the last on the center here. From here to here. Now we're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. And we're going to continue to do this until the end of the loom. And the same, grab the bottom two, hook it to the second to the last on the center. Right here. And make sure we keep all the bands down so it won't pop out. And now remember to come back here and finish up the center. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one, and continue to do this until the end of the room. And now this one has so many bands here, so be careful when you pull it. So slowly pull it and hook it to the last one on the center here. And there are a lot of tension because so many bend here. You can use your hook, release some tension so you won't break on you. And now, since this one is a secure bend, I'm going to take both out and grab one end through the others, tight enough here, and then put this one back here while we're pulling it so you will hold it for us. That way you won't come undone. Now it's time to take it up. You can use your hook to help you to release the band. And now, after you pull it out, we want to highly secure band first so it won't pop out accidentally. You can come back here, find some band, put your hook through, and pull it through here. So you will hold it for us. That way it won't come up. And now we just need to fix it and make it look nice and neat. Just pull it slowly. And this one actually is a pretty easy fix. And this is our soda bottle. It can be done like this, and if you want to have a little touch on it, that's fine. I did, I put a little label to represent the logo here. So if you want to do that, I'm just going to take one white band and put your hook through in between the red band here, and then put your white band here and grab it through here like this, and then then come back here and grab the other end through like this and you can just dip it like that on a cap here you can take one single pen and drop it along for like uh, maybe three times one two maybe three loops should be fun here is our soda bottle thank you for watching see you next time